The roads are torn up around here. But the bike path isn't too bad. Uh, it's mostly green there. So I think I'll turn this off and get some more. I'm going to find a place to sketch. And I'm going to use my new stool, which I'll show when I set up. Alright, so I stopped here to sketch and I'm just at the intersection of Lincoln and 34th and Lincoln is another bike path and so this is actually a pretty busy intersection but I'm going for it anyway. I'll zoom in on the house that I caught my eye. It's got a lot of nice structure, a lot of nice colors and a lot of autumn around it. Uh, you can hear the chatty neighbor. Anyway, this is the stool that I Bought. I saw someone had just done a quick demo at the um, Urban Sketchers in, I believe it was Porto. And so I bought one. Uh, you have to get it off QVC, and I think I paid $31 for it. And they had a coupon, so that kind of took care of the shipping. They don't have anything like this on Amazon. And I'll do a quick demo um, when I get home and can have somebody film me or set up my arm and, I'll, and how you open it and close it. But, I'm uh, gonna go sit on it and I'll do a, hopefully less than a half an hour sketch and see how it feels to sit on it for half an hour. Right now, um, I'll get started. All right, here's the drawing so far. Let's see, let's see, get, get that out in the light. There's the house. And I think I'm going to try to paint it here. This seat is very comfortable. I don't know how long I've been here, but I'm um, getting a couple odd looks from all the people that stop and possibly the people behind me who live in the house behind me but I'm on the sidewalk so I feel like I'm okay I left out a couple of things like the light and there was a crow but the, just the colors are really cool so I'm gonna color I'm gonna paint it now maybe we'll see so this is ended up being instead of the urban sketching um, completion I decided to make uh, make this about the stool so this is the stool that I got it's the mini max telescoping portable stool seat by Microdel and this is QVC it was 3162 with shipping and handling 550 which you know Amazon has free shipping however I think I mentioned earlier I had a coupon that took care of the shipping so that's the stool I got so now I'm going to show you a little bit of the actual details so this is the way it comes I'm not exactly sure how much it weighs I'd probably say five Pounds, maybe a little over five pounds I should have checked as usual it has this strap and I'll show you that at the end uh, when I move the camera but it has these two finger holes here and two finger holes here it was only available in gray I wanted like gold or something but I got gray but that's okay that's <laughs> so gray here kind of works all right and what you do is you put your fingers in the you put your fingers inside both sides and then you, I'm way up to the camera, all right? And then you pull and you decide how much you want it. So if you just need it for a little bit, then after you, after you pull it to the, what you want, you just turn it and it, it stops right there. So if I just needed a little stool, there we go. But uh, what I had in the beginning of the video is I took it all the way out to the side. It measures, hey, look at this, I have the thing. It measures um, about two feet. So, it's two feet, let's see, it's one foot, yeah, it's about two feet high, and you just sit on here, and when you're done, you twist it, you pull it out, you twist it the other way, and you let it slide back into itself. And then, like I said, I'll show you, this wraps around for storage purposes. Well, it does, trust me. <laughs> but what I really want to show you is, um, let's see if I can get this. So let me turn this and hope that I'm getting this on camera because I really don't know. Whoops. Straighten this up. You know, you stopped filming for two months and I forget how all my gear works sometimes. Um, so I'm hoping this is in the camera. I really can't tell, but uh, it just is like a little purse and it's not very heavy 
So if you're worried about that, um, the only thing I, I wish it, well, I think you can make it bigger. So let me go back down here. I don't know if that got on there. I'll have to check it. I may have to refilm this. But the deal is, what I was going to say is, I think I can make this bigger and treat it like a, instead of a shoulder. Oh, yeah, look at that. You know, I probably knew this when I got it. I probably checked it out. So I can do maybe a cross body, make it one size, and make it cross body. I'm not, I don't know if that's big enough to do cross body. I'll check. Just give me a second. There's some Velcro. Oh, huh. Velcro's apart. Wow. Look at this. It's Discovery Day for me. Anyway. Um, I don't think it's large enough to do crossbody, but you can do um, longer, I suppose, if you want. Well, then what's the point? Hmm. I wish I wasn't doing this on camera, but I completely didn't realize this feature was in there. Eh, I'll check it out. Maybe put something in the comments about it. But in any case, just to wrap it up, I uh, love this stool. I highly recommend it because for me, and I don't know if everybody feels this way, but uh, what I've found is that the, um, I'll stop fumbling with that because I'm sure it's inter interfering with my voice, but yeah, I'll fix that later. Trust me. But what I found about this is um, that if I have to stand for too long to sketch, my back starts to hurt. And I, this is lightweight. I can carry it um, on my bike. I haven't figured out how to do that yet, but I'm going to. And I'll, I'll film that at some point when the weather gets nicer and I start biking again. But um, I walked in that video that uh, at the beginning I walked with this on and it never once did I feel like, oh man, this is heavy. I wish I didn't have it. It was perfect and it was comfortable for the whole time I sketched. I didn't uh, feel any discomfort whatsoever. So I'm very, uh, I recommend this highly and uh, five out of five stars in my book. So get yourself one if you don't have a, a good stool. It, uh, I did try out those triangular ones when I was at a sketching I was at an oil painting uh, how when you watch somebody paint you know dem demo and I sat on one of those triangular ones and it was so uncomfortable that I I just had to get up and stand so this is in my book the way to go worth every penny all right thanks for watching and look for another video soon uh, as soon as I can get it together